Shih Tzu and Lhasa Apso are two very similar dog breeds that are oftentimes confused with each other. In this video I will tell you what are the main differences between them not only in their appearance but also in personality. Hi, it's Rajin from Roka. Look, have you ever had a problem to distinguish Shih Tzu and Lhasa Apso? Well, you are not alone. I had a problem as well. So I decided to find out what are the key differences between them and how to distinguish them properly. The reason why they look similar is that Shih Tzu is direct descendant of Lhasa Apso. There are two key differences in their appearance. The first one is their size. Shih Tzu is smaller, Lhasa Apso is larger. Shih Tzu height is between 20 to 25 centimeters and weighs between 5 to 6 kilograms. On the other hand, Lhasa Apso height is between 25 to 30 centimeters and weighs up to 8 kilograms. This is not a big difference, but if you will see Shih Tzu and Lhasa Apso face to face, you can be almost always sure that the bigger one is Lhasa Apso. Both breeds have long, beautiful and fluffy coat and their coat is their biggest difference in appearance and the easiest way to tell them apart. If you will see side parting on the coat and the coat is straight with black tips on muzzle and ears, you can be sure that this is Lhasa Apso. Shih Tzu does not have the dividing line and their coat is more wavier. I'll be honest with you, for me it's very hard to tell them apart only based on their face but Lhasa Apso has narrower face, longer muzzle and smaller eyes. On the other hand Shih Tzu has more flat face and bigger and rounder eyes. <laughs> Both dogs can be described as loving and affectionate companions with average intelligence. They don't require much exercise since their energy level is low to medium. Both can also be described as non-shedding. Sometimes they are good for people with allergies and neither of these dogs drool. They don't have herding, hunting or fighting instincts. But there is one very important difference in their personality which is connected to their purpose in history. While Lhasa Apso was bred to be watchdog, a kind of protector, Shih Tzu was bred exclusively as companion dog. This was thousand years ago but you can change your character completely. This is why Shih Tzu is more friendly and trusting to everyone, even complete strangers. But Lhasa Apso is more independent and they are suspicious towards strangers. Lhasa Lhasa Apso can be described as watchdog guard or protector, while Shih Tzu is typical companion dog. Tell me in comments if you are more Shih Tzu or Lhasa Apso person. I hope that now it will be easier for you to tell them apart after watching this video. If you like the video, subscribe, turn the notifications on and check our Instagram and Facebook links to everything in description. See you in the next video.